Hi, my name is Chris Kovach. I am the Regional Sales Consultant in Northeastern Florida for Toby Dynabox. Today we're going to quickly cover how to download the Compass application to your iPad as a professional SLP or clinician wishing to use the Compass application within a professional environment. The first thing we need to do is create a MyToby Dynabox account. So if you can navigate to MyTobyDynabox.com, you'll come to a homepage that looks like this. If you already have a member's login, please just select the box and log into your account. If you have not created an account, please select the blue box in the center of the screen and create the account. You'll need to enter your name, a username, password, email address, verify the country in which you live in, and then that you have checkboxed the read and accepted Toby Dynabox terms of service. You would then register your, uh, your new username. Once you register, you can sign into your account. Go ahead and enter my username or my email, my password, and you can opt to leave yourself signed in so when you come back to the web page in the future, you don't have to put in those credentials again. And then sign into the account. Once you're within the account, you need to make your account now a professional account. And one of the major differences between a professional account and a standard account is that with your ASHA information, it allows you to have full access of the Compass software without the loss of the voices after the 30-day trial period would typically expire. So you would get recurring six-month access for no charge at all. So what we need to do is go to the store, go to Compass, go to Get Compass, scroll all the way down to the bottom, and you'll see the professional option. Here you can verify your membership by putting in your ASHA numbers. Once you put in your ASHA numbers, you agree to the software uh, rules and restrictions, and then hit verify. It will then turn your account into a professional account, allowing you the access that you need. Once you're redirected back to your homepage, we can again go to um, the store, Compass, Get Compass, and here you can see there's options for getting the paid for Compass application, but there's not an option for you to get the trial version. Now what you can do, if you're doing this on an iPad, you can go either through iTunes by using the iTunes lookup and looking for Toby Dynavox Compass Connect as the software, or if you're within the My Toby Dynavox webpage on the iPad, you can go to Support, Downloads, scroll to the bottom, and then click on the Download iTunes for Toby Dynavox Compass app trial subscription slash companion version. And we can click Download for iTunes. From here, you can download the Compass application or view it in iTunes. I apologize, it's going to make me open up my iTunes account. Okay, so if I'm in iTunes and I want to search for Compass Connect, there we go. So within iTunes, I can search for Compass Connect and you can see that it's just marked as Get, meaning that it's a free subscription. So you can click on that icon. It'll give you a little bit more of an overview. Make sure it's the software you're looking to download, which it is. And we can click Get. Now I'm not currently signed in, but you would have to sign in with your username and password and download uh, the application. And it's that easy. Once you have the application downloaded, what you would need to do is install the application on your iPad and then open the application. When you open the application, you will be prompted, and I apologize that I don't have uh, a new install version to walk you through this, but when you first open the application, you'll be prompted with a screen that looks like this. Here, you want to put in your username or email address and your password for the MyToby Dynavox account, and you want to click Sign In. Now, this will only work if you are connected to a Wi-Fi uh, connection within the facility or your home, but what it does is it allows the software to link to your newly created MyToby Dynavox account, thus allowing it to show that you are linked to a professional account and therefore not shutting off the voice engines after the 30-day trial has been completed. Once you're signed in, you'll see that over here, 
it will show that you are currently signed in under this username account, which would be obviously your email address or your username. And from there, you should be good to go. If you were to leave the software and go back to your MyToby Dynavox account and just go to your homepage, you'll see that you have devices and subscriptions over here on the left-hand side. If you came through an iPad, you would see that it would be linked over here. It would say, you know, iPad with uh, Compass software, and it would have a serial number and when you added that, uh, that device to your account. And that's all you need to do. If you can see the iPad that you're holding in this account here, and you've logged in on that iPad, then the two are linked and you're ready to go. If you have any questions or you run into any problems, please don't hesitate to contact, contact us at 1-800-344-1778. Thanks, and have a great day.